it's been good for me personally. It's made me a, a better person and I've formed a lot of good friendships. It's given me more than what I've given it. Yeah, I just generally like the game. I started in volleyball because I was basically not skilled enough to play any of the major sports. So we were just sort of throwing a volleyball with a net and said go and whack around with that. We moved to Port Augusta and my dad was involved with the YMCA and he ran this um, session for old business people. So the last 10 minutes or so he uh, had us playing volleyball. I sort of took over, but by that time we'd sort of made the session more volleyball than anything else. May 75, I think, that we would start an association, but it was outside on bitumen courts, which wasn't all that conducive. Some matches had to finish with car lights turned on. But at our peak we had eight, eight clubs with two men's and two women's each, A and B, men's and women's. A figure of about 420 uh, participants, sort of six in your head. The lowest point was probably about you know, 90, mid 90s I suppose, um, when uh, the railways virtually closed down. And what we were left with then, I think in the A grade men's, we, for a couple of seasons there, we only had three teams, which was pretty much, can't go any lower than that. Volleyball was just hanging on at that stage. Well, it's never really recovered where I'm comfortable with it. As it's turned out, every, every one of my kids has, has, um, has played the game and played it fairly well. I've been a bit surprised in uh, the way my grandkids have sort of taken on. I suppose I like to just have given them the opportunity. And that's probably the motivation now anyway for still being involved is that um, I reckon that any, every person should have the opportunity to play the game. I think Port Augusta is a better place because it's got volleyball in it. Really my only um, ambition for the future is to make sure volleyball has a future in Port Augusta. But physically, obviously, I'm uh, not quite as competent as when I was at my peak. When I've got to mix it with A graders, I'm a bit sort of out of my league at times. It seems like every season I get something which, which aches at the moment. It's my left shoulder, like for no reason. It's just probably arthritis, I suppose. I can say I've probably got more days behind me than what I've got in front of me. That's probably fair enough, because I've got 66 years behind me. I don't imagine I've got 66 in front of me. I don't know if you know Eddie's eye or not. I think he played till he was 68, so I suppose that once I get to there, I can say, well, there's nothing left for me to achieve. <laughs> So uh, I can go whenever I like. So it is a game that allows you to, well, pretty much play until I suppose you drop dead, really. 